Once the basic size and desired fit of a feature is known, the metric international tolerance chart, as shown here, can be used to calculate the upper and lower limits of size. For example, if I wanted an IT6 fit for this 2.5 millimeter hole and was using a hole base fit, I would first find the proper size range for 2.5 millimeters. I would start in the far left hand column and go down until I find the 2.5 millimeter range. In this case, it is the first row here. Then I would follow this row across to the right until I find the IT6 column. And now I see that the tolerance should be 0.006 or 6 microns. Since this is a hole base fit, I know the minimum size of the hole is 2.5 and the maximum size is 2.506. In order to find the shaft sizes, I would need to go to the proper metric fit chart. However, if I knew the shaft had a tolerance grade of IT9, I would know the tolerance on the shaft is 0.025 or 25 microns. If this was designed using a shaft base fit, then I would know the maximum shaft size is 2.5 and the minimum is 2.475, and I would also know the tolerance on the hole is 6 microns. When selecting the fit for this 2.5 millimeter feature, I should work with the preferred fit chart as shown here. If a loose running fit was chosen using a hole based system, the hole would have an H11 tolerance and the shaft would have a C11 tolerance. This would make the minimum hole size 2.5 the maximum 2.56, and the minimum shaft size 2.38, the maximum shaft 2.44, while the clearance at the maximum material condition would be 60 microns, and the least material condition would generate a clearance of 180 microns. If a close running fit was required, then the shaft and hole sizes would be found here, or for a locational clearance, the feature sizes would be found here. If a transition or interference fit were required, I would need to switch to this chart. A locational transition hole base fit would create a hole tolerance of 10 microns, a shaft tolerance of 6 microns, and at the maximum material condition an interference of 6 microns, while a clearance of 10 microns would exist at the least material condition. Whereas a medium drive fit would no longer see any clearance, but only interference. For this fit, the interference at the maximum material condition would be 20 microns and 4 microns at the least material condition. If a shaft base clearance was required, I would use this chart. Recall when using a shaft base system, the maximum shaft size is the basic size, 2.5 millimeters in this case. A close running fit would make the maximum shaft 2.5, the minimum 2.49, while the maximum hole would be 2.52, the minimum 2.506, and the clearance at maximum material condition 6 microns, while the clearance at the least material condition would be 30 microns.